Okay, and let's start with in here. Welcome to part three of the first issue of PlayStation Underground. Oh man, okay. Yep, now they stores some of the demos for here. It's a pretty short disc, however, though. But they fixed that problem um, on, on issue four. They changed all the demos into the second disc. So anyway. Oh yeah, I gotta tell you one more note. Um, I did not do the cheats to unlock the music videos because I don't want to get copyright claim. So therefore, no. Just tap those cheats and you'll be all set to go. All right, um, for car chart, yeah, I decided not to do it. I'm sorry, I just, that's not my forte in my opinion. It's, it's not a bad game, it's, it's just something I don't want to play there. All right, let's go to Tomb Raider. Now this game, I'm not very good at. <laughs> um, you know, it's okay though, because I don't mind playing some different games that I might not good at, but I try it for the fun of it. Alright, let's see if this uh, Laura Croft um, tried to get to the end of the demo. Okay, here's me going into the Temple of Doomed. And I'm gonna get eat. I, I think there's mice creatures coming up. Oh no, wolves! Watch out! Laura, don't kill the wolves! Let them go! Let them be! What are you doing this? This is torture! Don't do- Oh, I like wolves! Uh, can you believe you killed those wolves? Oh well. Anyway. Oh. No, no. Don't- Just leave those wolves alone. They have cubs! Oh. Sheesh, Laura, you're a murderer. Yep, you're just shooting crazy around. Hmm, I wonder what's under here. Oh no, it's... Hey, 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 it's Yogi Bear. I just want a pitiki basket. Give me a pitiki basket. Why you kill me? Laura, you killed Yogi. Now Boo Boo is going to have no friends. Good job. The ranger's not going to like it, Laura Croft. You said boo-boo. Anyway. Okay. She's going to go down there in the water. Actually, there's like two ways to get to a certain area. You can all you can swim down there. Which I didn't do that because I just just, just pull around and see what, what the graphics and everything looks like. It'll look like. And, yeah, and for its age, it didn't age well, in my opinion. It's just, it's just not as good as like Warcraft uh, 2 Raider 2 and 3. And the rest, last revelations. But when they made um, Tomb Raider 4, uh, the Angel of Darkness, they made the game more cheap, cheaply made, and that was the Eos um, last Warcraft game, and they haven't made a game ever since. And there's not even one Warcraft game in PS2. But then they made the reboot for the PS4, so that at least that one turns out much better than the. The Angel of Darkness for Tomb Raider series. It's just too bad, though. It was not a bad series, in my opinion. I thought there's still good games. Not, not perfect for, for my taste, but you know. Yeah, Laura looks like she's just going looking around. It's like, hmm, what I had to do next? Actually, there, there's that lever we just saw earlier. I have to pull it down to go to the next area. And I have a heck of a hard, hard time trying to get through it. But I just wanted to show you what you can go do for that. Oh, look at bats. I, I'm Batman. No one messed with Batman. Great. Now Batman is not very happy because you kill his bats. Nice job, Laura. Boy, I wonder what the... One of the animal lovers out there were going to say about Laura Croft. She... Get rid of all those poor animals. They all deserve it. Oh, just let you know. Um, if you get to the end of the demo, you all uh, face the T Rex. And I saw my older brother playing this game, and he was put. Um, he was to say, "Hey, look, a T Rex! That was awesome." 
But, however, yeah. I get to say, yeah, I'm... Just like I said, I'm just not into that. Oh, I guess she's gonna say something. No. 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 I'm not attractive? And she said no. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Anyway, um... Actually, I do like the details in this game. Now, the details in this game is actually pretty cool. The cre creature um, animation spots look nice. Um, the guns look good. Um, bullet effects are good. I saw the war effects. Yeah, actually, this turned out to be a good, a good game. PlayStation makes pretty good games, especially for its time. Even though it's just like, ah, uh, nah, because I like the graphics from the newer games. But, you know. I, well, for for me, it doesn't, for the PS4, it's nice to have good graphics, but just gameplays, it's just like reconning the, the classics that we know and love. It's like, come on, you gotta do something different, better than that, you know? Oh, well. So, anyway, so, I'm, I'm just, just browsing around. I'm, I'm not actually finishing the demo because I, I, I forgot to do that. And here's the thing, though. If you don't beat the level at a certain time limit from their time limit of the demo, you have to restart all over again. Which is cool to do that, so just in case you tried to beat the demo. Which is nice. So that's a good demo, anyway. Okay, let's go to, go to more demos. Alright. Okay, the next one I'm not going to play, too. Because, um, that's more mission-based, in a way. MechWarrior 2 is actually one of the hardest PlayStation 2 games to, to deal with. And I was like, eh, no thank you. Spider, this is like a, uh, an action puzzler um, thing for the Spider. Just had to go through and had to beat the enemies. I try it once, and it's like, yeah, not my thing. Alright, let's go play Rich Racer, a.k.a. Rich Racer 3. Let's go and try to get first place this time, like Rich Racer Revolution I did on the demo disc. Yeah, the, yeah this game, uh, the controls are still the same. The graphics is actually really good. I love the details of the menus. Pretty cool. Racers, start your engines and let's Okay, get no sex jokes here, lady. Let's move on. <laughs> All right. Okay. Um, I can say this. Um, I used to have this copy long ago, but I got rid of it. Probably just got just got bored. Oh well, actually, it's not. Actually, in my opinion, is the game is still great. Just not as good like the first two Rich Racer games, um, and definitely not as good as Gran Turismo. Gran Turismo, that is a racer right there, folks. If you want a racer, that one you gotta get. Also, Need for Speed 3 Hot Pursuit and High Stakes, those are good racers too. Uh, I would definitely get those games. Woohoo, look at me going. Vroom. Oh, wait, here goes the turn. Oh, hit the wall, hit the wall. Can't admit, though. The details of the backgrounds are excellent. Oh, what's up with that purple car? Okay, here it goes. Vroom! Yeah, actually... Oh, hit the wall again. Hit the wall again there. Okay, watch out for the turn. Hit, oh, hit the wall again. Come on, you do it. Here it goes, here it goes. Vroom! Alright. It seems you get, even though this says there's a time limit on the bottom left, it's like, why do we need a uh, time limit for okay. racers? You just, just race the game. Unless there's like a missions or something like that, but... Uh-oh. Too bad. You blew it. That's, <clears throat> that's Mr. Game Over, but to you, Missy. <laughs> Alright, well, that's the end for that demo. Well, all I can say is that the Ray Tracer game is actually actually still a good game. For anyone who likes racing games and who likes Ray Tracer, yeah, I recommend 
getting that one too. So anyway, okay, let's go on to the coming soon. This one demonstrates of what two games are coming up. Um, okay, this one, uh, it's uh, Odd Apes Odd World Odyssey. I didn't bother playing it because it's pretty much more of a puzzler. And I did try it before and I was confused of the game, so I was like, yeah. Okay, here, here's another game I didn't even bother playing. And this one is called um, The Lost World Jurassic Park, which I do like the game. Uh, like, sorry. I do like the movie, but the game, no. The game is pretty much just a, ca a cash grab in a way. I love PlayStation, but one thing I learned about being a gamer is I don't play ga uh, video games based on based on movies because they usually always screw it up. So that's why I didn't bother playing this one. I'm glad this one's only a video because I'm not going to get this one, that's for sure. Oh, I showed the cheat earlier about the NHL Face-Off 97 contest, which I didn't bother showing it because it's actually, you have to um, type the cheat, uh, cheat and enter the contest. I'm thinking, it's still great, it's still great to do that. I wish I knew that sooner I could win something from NHL Face-Off 97 contest, but oh well. Ooh, T-Rex. Yeah, I gotta get that movie on Blu-ray. That, that's a good movie. Not the game. <laughs> Alright. We're done that done yet. We have one more cheat to show. And here it is. Okay. Resident Evil 2 Sneak Preak. Oh, a peak. Sorry, I had to do that joke just like Johnny said that on, <laughs> on Super Mario 64 for his channel of Super Gamers. Anyway, so here they showed the concept idea of Resident Evil 2. Which Leon is still the same character. Um, that background right there is actually the same there, but except they changed the space a little bit. They cut down there to make it a little different. Yeah, that's a little that's a little more different there. Okay, and that's Claire, but they changed her a lot on the next one. Let's see, she got blonde hair, but she got brunette hair um, on the um, selling uh, the actual version of the game. But you gotta admit though, Resident Evil 2, oh my gosh, one of my favorite games ever. Especially you can play two scenarios from both of them, and you can get like Honk, um, Tofu, which, that was really stupid. Also, if you get the Adult Shock version, you can get the uh, Extreme Battle Mode, which, that's pretty cool. It's a survival, um, definitely survival horror. All you do is just have to um, kill all the creatures and try to get to the helicopter. That's all you have to do. Ooh, zombie action. Poof. Yeah, I'm not gonna flag for this um, for this video though because I'm only showing only parts of it, so that so that doesn't count for that. Now, if it was a mature game, yeah, I will do that because I the one the kids is like, oh my goodness, you shouldn't watch these mature games because that's not good for you. So, yeah, ooh, doggies. Yeah, deals are Dobermans. They're infected with the a G virus. It's pretty sad that Raccoon City um, would be a good, great place to live, but unfortunately the zombies take over. And that's pretty sad. George A. Romero, thank you so much for creating Night of the Living Dead. Without your, you with the horror uh, zombie genre, this game would never be made. Well, I'm exhausted for this disc, uh, issue. We'll do more issues along the way. I'll do a new issue next week, so I'll stay tuned for that. Thank you for watching this um, three part here. More demos and gameplay and more stuff to come. I'm Alan Star Wars Fan here. Thank you for watching. And it's time to game more. Subscribe to your YouTube channel as well. Have a good day. And thank you so much for subscribing.